Let me get a couple things off my chest before uh, we get to our first guest, Bobby Rushi. Uh, look, first of all, congratulations to the Toronto Raptors. We're a soccer show here, but we live here in the GTA. So congrats to the Toronto Raptors. And I want to say this in regards to Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment. And, and I mean this right from the heart. This is not something that I'm doing to kiss up the Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment because many years ago, I would take shots at them left, right, and center because they deserved it. But tonight, I'm going to put it right out there. For all you still out there taking shots at Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment, Give your head a shake. You should be ashamed of yourself. And I'll tell you why. This is simply why. Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment, whether it's been the Toronto Maple Leafs forking out all sorts of money for players like Fanouf that's gone, Kessel that was gone, Mike Babcock, the best in my opinion anyway, the best either 1 or 1A coach in the NHL, Brendan Shanahan, on and on and on, they do it with the hockey team. They sign the checks. The Toronto Raptors, Masai Ujiri, Casey, Lowry, DeRozan, all they've done is signed the checks and kept their mouths shut. Now TFC, let's talk about it. Jermaine Defoe from past, signed the check, kept the mouth shut, and they did it. And that was a bust, but they did it. Jovinko, they signed the check. He will become, in my mind, the greatest player in MLS history from now to the day I'm long gone. Absolutely the greatest player in MLS history. He will go down as you can book it. He will destroy he will destroy the record of goals he had last year being not uh, named to Italy's squad. I can tell you right now he'll be motivated uh, 10 times more than he was at the start of the season just because he wasn't selected. He will smash that record. So Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment, whether it's Michael Bradley, Jovinko, uh, whether it was Defoe in the past, you name it, we could go on and on. All they've ever done is signed the checks and kept their mouth shut and left their management team to do their job, left the presidents to do their job, left the coaches to do their job, and they've been an absolute fantastic ownership here. The board should be applauded. Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment should be applauded. Look, in the last five, six, seven, let's say 10 years, that's all they've done with this franchise TFC. Signed the checks, kept their mouth shut, improved the stadium, uh, improve all sorts of other things, whether it's the Kia training grounds where they sunk in a ton of money. Good on Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment. So to you, the board of Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment, Larry Tannenbaum, a, a guy that I know is very passionate about basketball, loves the Leafs, enjoys TFC. Thank you for putting your money where your mouth is and signing the checks and not putting your nose in the business. Thank you, Maple Leaf Sports and Entertainment.